Hello guys, my name is Biscuit and welcome back to my channel. If you're here for the very first time, hello and welcome in. Super excited to have you here. Thank you so much for choosing to watch this video. Today we are reacting to an American werewolf in London. I did check, this is supposed to be comedy horror. So I do hope this time I will be able to interpret the movie and try to like go into the zone as best as I can. Thank you so much for being here. Thank you so much for supporting my channel. Special thanks to my Patreon that are you know helping in an extra way as well but of course if you guys like this reaction and you like the type of content that i do on my channel please consider subscribing it does help a lot brings more people in and lets us expand our community I'll put this headset on and um if you guys are ready i'm ready i'm gonna just scooch here into my little cubicle <laughs> let's go an american we werewolf in london I'll have to tell you because I'm Romanian and we are very popular with our vampires, right? Of course we know about werewolves too. We call them Virkolac. That's his Proctor. You have lovely sheep. Boy, <laughs> keep off the moors. No sheep shit in my pack. <laughs> <laughs> a poop sheep. There's nothing mediocre about Debbie Klein's body. <laughs> so right now they're in London and they want to go to Rome to meet this girl. She has no choice. What? You know, it just fascinates me how much energy you spend on somebody so dull. How many years of foreplay is that? All of them. <laughs> she says she likes me too much. Knock, knock. Who's there? Who? No. <laughs> A knock, knock joke. They're never getting old, right? I think this movie was filmed with people really didn't fear anything. I mean, you're going in a little village with exactly 15 houses. What could go wrong, right? Right? Would you rather the Hilton? All right. Maybe you can get a tea. <laughs> oh, darts. Nice. <clears throat> Hello. We have a cross there on the wall. It's uh, very cold outside. May we come in? Guys, there's gonna be dinner. Population 2000. What do you expect, guys? Yes, do you have any hot soup? No. Then you have tea? No. Oh. But I can make some for you. Uh huh. You could have like an, um, a mix of an Irish tea, you get nice a tea. Group. And then you put some alcohol in it. Look at that. I saw that when it entered. Pretty awful if you ask me. Here, Gladys, Tom. A five pointed star. It's used for witchcraft. Rituals. They want me to ask them if they're burning candles to ward off monsters. Right. Mm. <laughs> oh. <laughs> uh, let's see who's gonna be eaten first. Atlantic on its way to New York. A joke's out of the Mexican. <laughs> <laughs> I feel like I should have gotten that, but I don't. <laughs> well, everybody stop laughing. You made me miss. His question. Sorry. Made you miss. I've never missed that board before. <laughs> Are you kidding? I'm starved. There's no food here. It's only alcohol. You just can't let them go. Go. Keep clear of the moors. So maybe the cross is there to keep the werewolves away? Yeah. I think maybe. What the hell was that all about? The boy they could play darts. I can't see what the can't let them go. the thing is. is. It's murder then. Then murder it is. Protecting the secret. What sounds now? I mean, to be fair, everything strange is happening on full moons always, right? <laughs> they were ashamed. Yeah. <laughs> Guys, keep to the road. Oh, David. Yes, I'm well aware of how. Do you have like a tent? Santa Lucia. Make more noise. A voice amp amplifier would have been great. The fog is coming. Perhaps will be safe in the rain. Is there not like an inn? And what do you think they'd say? Do you hear it? Oh. I heard nothing. <laughs> what about this one? Did you hear this one? Not I. Okay. Can we get another owl? Did you hear that? Owl. I heard that. What was it? Could be a lot of things. Yeah. Like a wolf? A coyote. 
There aren't any coyotes in England. No. <laughs> and stick to the road. Oops. You had two jobs to do, guys. Stick to the road. The slaughtered lamb. Yeah. And beware the moon. Come on, where? Anywhere. I think we should just keep moving. I still didn't understand exactly. I know that they are in England for three months, but what, what for? Like, just visiting? Explo exploring? Isn't this fun? It sounds like a lion's roar. Oh shit, what is it? Yeah. It's a sheepdog or something. A sheepdog? Where are we going? I don't know. I'll tell you when we get there. Okay, <laughs> oh! <laughs> this is like a freaking... <laughs> this is like a freaking bear. Holy hell. It took him a little while to remember his friend. But hey, I would have done the same. Would have run. I would have run. Jack. That's a freaking bear, isn't it? Okay. Jack. Mm -hmm. The scratch on his cheek. I'm going to look into your eyes. No, it's kind of good. No, it's I think they're talking right. about circumcision. Yes, doctor. Then get on with it. <laughs> yes, doctor. You're dismissed. Go about your duties. Yes, doctor. Okay, he wants the room for himself. Yes, doctor. What exactly did he call out? Jack. He said, Jack. Must have been a very powerful man. They usually just go and say it uh, was an attack animal. No, sir. An animal attack they threw around. Good day, doctor. I'm Dr. Hirsch. Where's Jack? Dead. David, I'd like you to prepare yourself. Your friend is dead. What? Not beating a, a, around the bush. Straightforward. Your friend dead. Sorry. Jack is dead? Who are you people? <laughs> What's going on here? Where's Jack? Get, get your hands off me. This is no reason for hysterics. Uh, Mr. Kessler? His friend died. And I have given them permission to do so. Thank you very much, Mr. Collins. He'll rest now. You don't have any reason to, to, to be mad, but here, your friend died. You've been unconscious since you were brought in three weeks ago. Wow, three weeks. Nurse Price will see to all your needs. You rest. I don't know, this doctor gives me the feeling... A wolf. Oh, it looked a little bit more like a beer. Beer. Yes, I believe you did. Oh, yeah, I'm sure I shall. I don't know, I, I was having... Brawl, the... I'm sure I can survive another excruciating evening. The impression that the doctor knows. <laughs> yes. Send them in. No tea for you, good sir. Uh, maybe not, no thanks. <laughs> maybe later. <laughs> no problem. Passed away, uh, an old war wound. You're fired. Dead. No more calls. This guy is so clumsy. I never understood people that go into other people's offices and they start touching things like that. Like, why? Holy hell. Inspector, the boy seems all right to me. <laughs> Damn what, sir. And I don't rightly know, sir. Seems like one wants to close the case and another one wants to actually investigate. When the matter is now closed, we will trouble you enough with that. Of Be course. Right. Doctor? It's my sanity I'm beginning to worry about. Maybe this... Uh, all of this uh, movie shaky camera style... Um, it's a little bit dizzying. Anyone else feels that? Like when they record and you see like not the stabilized image. The fake blood. Feeling better? No. <laughs> you got your answer. Mr. Kessler. He's probably listening yes. to whale sounds. <laughs> you haven't eaten your lunch. Shall I be forced to feed you, Mr. Kessler? Or beatings. Right. I was in hospital twice, but I never had nurses like this. My nurses were like, eat. No. <laughs> what are those little pieces? They're like for babies. Will I have to take such drastic action again, David? I mean, he likes it, so... 
is flirting. Food edition. So if he was in a coma, for coma, thing, for three weeks. You've never had bad dreams before. Well, sure, as a kid, but never so real. Okay. Never so weird. A man can't do that to someone with his bare hands. I mean, like. You'd be surprised what horrors a man is capable of. But did you see Jack? One, two, three, four. A man has five fingers. We'd have seen it on the telly. On the telly. We're leaving this hospital in three or four days. Well, Please. if... Please. Remain yeah. sane. If it was a man... Our responsibility. Would have been five, no? Like Dr. Oh. Hirsch, I'd rather not be by myself. Five scratch marks. Of course he's gonna send him the beautiful nurse. I just wonder if all of those images with him eating the deer and everything like that are actually his inner wolf doing all of those, like in his subconscious now, because he was in a coma for three weeks, no? Shall I read to you? Mm -hmm. Yeah, okay. This, this woman is like... Yankee at King Arthur's court. The nurse Samuel of the L. year. This is like, like socket, puppet socket thing, no? That's good, it's good, it's a good yeah. aggressive behavior. Better than my ass. So he returned back to America. Okay, that's definitely a nightmare. So he's dreaming that people, masked people, are gonna kill him and his family and everything. I've just had a nightmare. <laughs> a dream in a dream? Yeah, that's nasty. A dream in a dream is, wow, is bad. Good morning and a good day to you. Can I have a pizza toast? <laughs> He's losing his mind. Thanks a lot. But hey, they did great with the costumes and the uh, prosthetics. Am I asleep now, awake or what? Buried someplace. That's in the just yard. makeup, guys. Yeah. Amazing, right? I'm going completely crazy. <laughs> we were attacked by a werewolf. I'm not listening to this. Okay. On the moors. Must be destroyed. Which is your friend? Which is you? It's you, David. Okay. Last what? words. Please don't cry. <laughs> I'm, I'm still amazed by the by the makeup and everything. I have a kit. I can do similar things like the scars on the face, but not the throat. That is more um, advanced. It's basically just latex. You put it and then you cut it and you just put the bloody around it. You can... David, boy. I'm a werewolf. A werewolf. Sure, David. Are you all right now? I don't know. I'll let you know the next full moon. <laughs> what do you think? Um, maybe we I should think? keep you under observation. About the possibility of you becoming a monster in two days, or about visits from dead friends. <laughs> yes, I would think I so. I think she should yell for the sedative. I think so, too. Do you have somewhere to stay in London? Oh, nurse. <laughs> There's a shop on the corner. We'll get some food. I'm watching a lot of, like... Crime, crime and uh, murder trials and stuff and most of them like serial killers and everything was around these years now we know why apparently inviting total strangers to your house was normal or doing hitchhiking and stuff get a room you two jesus you mind if i get rid of this oh please there's only one bed you can have the couch i'm not in the habit of bringing home stray young american men well, I should hope not. I find you very attractive. And a little bit sad. You go, girl. I've had seven lovers in my life. Three of which were one night stands. We don't need to give a report card on that. No report card on that, it's fine. Perhaps you'd like to watch telly whilst I take a shower. I love this word, telly. Telly. It's like girls get more offended oh, about... <laughs> well, excuse me, sorry, good sirs. Okay, well... Now you have eight, I guess. Eight, eight, eight is a good number. Infinity, good number, wealth. You, you should stop maybe there. What I wanted to say is that it seems like um, she was... Uh, girls get offended when someone asks them how old they are. But then they just super open about how many partners they had. And the big bang just ding-donged. 
Is he dreaming? Is he dreaming? It's a 50-50. Look in the mirror, guys. Always look in the mirror. <laughs> Not tricking. I don't be a putz, David. Come here. This is a trick. If you look in the mirror, you're expecting it. You don't get jump scared otherwise. A nurse. I'm huh? learning. My sister loves horror movies, and these are like some tricks that she's she's using so she doesn't get scared. So she's always laughing at me when I get jump scared by cheap jump scares. I wanted to see you. You're a little bit green. Hi, David. Put that mm. down. Are you really dead, Jack? Triangle with his. You gotta take your own life. This guy is uh, really convincing here. This. Go away. David? Oh, he's not dreaming. What's wrong? I heard voices. Voices? It's just me, Alex. Just me being crazy. Claude Rains is Lon Chaney's father and he ends up killing him. <laughs> so now he's a werewolf too. I don't know what I'm talking so about. So did you love the guy that almost killed you? And finding you terribly attractive. Maybe both of you should get a check then. I mean, there are girls that they just like red flags. Um, in, you know, they, they are attracted to walking red flags. That's okay. I'm not really judging. Is this the doctor? That's the doctor, right? I think there are like three strangers in one month. Oh, yeah. Chess. Talking chess? Oh, surely I'm not that impressive. No. No, so you're not. <laughs> I don't feel like a game. I just want to check on the dogs. Dogs are fine. This guy seems to be the the. I'll just check. Big guy of the village. The one that plays chess. This. How many werewolves are there? Well. This guy is so. I'll be on my way then. <laughs> there is nothing for you here, sir. Uh-oh. He seems that he wanna talk. That's enough! I guess that's enough. I'm off. Mm. Oh. <laughs> 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 Animals always know better, guys. Trust. Welcome to Europe. <laughs> Where if you're like, you have one of those knobs, you cannot open the door from outside if you don't have the key. It's like an extra measure of security, let's just say. If he goes in the bed with his dirty feet, I'm gonna be livid. Nina, <laughs> starting in the news of the world tomorrow. <laughs> Naughty Nina. Oh. No, 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 you had dirty feet. And outside clothes. That's the true horror of this movie. The true horror right now is happening. I'm not hungry. The, the, the beating in Eastern European. I can only imagine them for outside clothes in the bed. Oof. Oof. Did he just left the door open? <laughs> Everything before the internet. If you, I guess if you didn't like to do manual work or read a book or I don't know, have some outside hobbies. Jesus Christ! He's losing his mind. Or he's trans... Oh, he's transforming. Oh, all right. Ta -na 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 -na. Alright, let's see what they did with this transformation. Look at the bright side, you're getting extra muscles. <laughs> I'm so sad. Alright. They did give you big canines. The whole uh, shift was quite crazy. <laughs> But they used, they, they probably used what they could then, right? 
Today is just CGI. It's quite easy to make this. I assume when you don't have access to... Wait, you didn't have access to a CGI back then. You were using costume and special effects and... Don't you guys have the impression that it looks like a bear? Sean, like, now, honest talk. Are in the park again. Is anyone there? <laughs> Is that you, Harry? Oh. He's meal number three. Ooh. A hand. But in such a deranged state, he might harm himself. Or perhaps other people. What shall we do? Should go to your apartment. And, and he didn't have any wounds because werewolf have ever uh, speed healings. Guys, I'm so scared of the gamer headset problem. When you get like a dent. Mary, mother of God. Next station, Piccadilly Circus. Newsletter? Like a paper? What what is it there? Are you no the hell is that? Cookies? Hello? I shall report this. Okay, Karen. Go make a complaint to the manager. <laughs> Good lord. Come on, show it to us. Oh, we want to see from the other perspective. My boy, you gotta have to hit the gym. You're out of breath. All right. Let's play what animal is that? They actually want to play what animal is there, all right. Lion, elephant, tiger, monkey, lioness, another monkey, and he's in the zoo. Now we know why he's not hungry. <laughs> I don't know, but this is a thought of eating people. Wolves are great. They're so beautiful. Uh, nice wolves. Um, I'm gonna, uh, I'll be right back. Look at the okay? tail Just, wiggle. Uh, <coughs> no worry, no, wolves are a peck. Anyone? Yes, I will. <laughs> Excuse me. Fancy <laughs> <laughs> jacket you have there, good sir. It suits you this color. I was worried about you. We didn't know where you were. Oh. Yeah, give me a half eaten victim's home? kiss. How does it taste like? Have you read the papers today? <laughs> listen to the radio or the television? A taxi will be faster. I expect you shortly. Does he behave strangely? No. St. Martin's Hospital. Right. I guess the testosterone is high. He's playing a silly joke. Be quiet. We have an argument. He's being silly. I don't know this girl. All right. <laughs> Come on, there's nothing to see. Come on, move along. Let's go. <laughs> Shakespeare is French. Jack was real. He tried to warn me and I thought I was crazy. David. I love you. Well, that was fast. I love you, Alex. Okay. We'll find him. Not to worry. I promise. You're not the one having the last word. It's area code 516. Four seven two ah. three four oh two. Okay, I understand. Four oh two. You wanna reverse all Thank of the you. charges he made against people in the US. Well where are they? Or no, so this where's is Max. Mom and Dad would never leave me alone when I'm I sorry guys, I don't know how these phone boots you work. Know, not ten and a half either. Will you be a good girl then? Is this his sister? Yeah, I love you. Goodbye. I 
do believe it's his sister. And when he said charges, I assume he meant that the one that picked up the phone has to pay for the call. But I thought in the fa phone booth you just put the coins and then that's it. Yeah, that will not work, my boy, because you heal faster. You probably heal faster than it will take you to bleed out. Well, time was definitely not good to you. But on the bright side, you, you look like you could star in Michael Jackson thriller video. Because this is thriller. thriller. How much is it? £2.80, sir. Naughty Nikki in action. Not you, you Twitter. I've never seen you before in my life. <laughs> oh, sorry. What can I say, Jack? Sure. You look awful. <laughs> Thank you crazy enough to do something like that but look at me. they surely did pick a nice background noise for the what corpse revelation I'm actually dialogue glad to see you jack i want you to meet some people <laughs> david kessler this is gerald bringsley you must die david kessler a car crash you could throw yourself in front of a tube drowning <laughs> I wonder what the director thought when he had all of the moaning on the background here. And those uh, self-analyving methods will all work. And here is our full moon. In this context... Can you imagine what other people think? Everybody's like going in and gets distracted by the movie. So yeah, definitely the director of this was like, I have a genius idea. Let's combine corn with murder. Okay, now now he looks here like a werewolf. In these scenes, he actually looked like a wolf. In the other one, he looked like a bear. <laughs> they see me rolling. They hate it. You should have hit it. In, oh shit. in driving school they tell you someone someone did what they told you in the driving school you never steer away from the animal you go into the animal that's what they teach you sister Hobbs said there's a disturbance in piccadilly circus involving some sort of mad dog all of the these police officers and no one shoots at this big animal let's see if the werewolf recognizes her or not is it true love? David, they're going to kill you. Hmm. David. I love you, David. But they did a good good job with the mask. Oh, I guess she, I guess he doesn't love you. I'm so sorry to tell you that. Alex, he tried to legit Eat your head. Did he manage to transform any anyone? Okay. So I know that this is... Um, okay, it's not really horror, not really a comedy for me, my perspective, watching this in 2023. Well, I know this is probably one of those movies that is a classic and a lot of you actually um, like it very, very much. So I have a question. What What do you like about this movie? What make you rec makes you recommend this movie? Like, what are the, the pros that you see into this movie? Me personally, considering that it's a classic movie and, you know, I am aware of the absence of CGI, CGI and uh, all of these um, other efforts they had to do like with special effects with um, with practical effects sorry with practical effects with the mask with the costumes with the makeup and I am I am I know that it, it's definitely not as beautiful looking as a CGI is but 
I still think they did a good job. In a few scenes, the wolf appeared as a bear, but that's maybe just my opinion. You don't you don't need to agree on that. But in the last scenes there, I could see a little bit more of a, the wolf. For a classic movie, I will give it a three star, but I'm super excited to read your comments, guys. I am uh, really, really curious to see what you enjoyed very, very much about the movie. I did notice some mistakes here and there. Like, for example, when he was following the metro guy, right? There were like some scenes filmed from both perspective when we were filming from the perspective of the guy there was like such a big distance between him and the monster but when they were filming from the perspective of the the werewolf there was like just a little bit of a distance between them but these are like just some details here and there that if you don't really think about it you don't catch them or you're not really interested in them i mean i i watch this i see this due to the fact that I, I like following for this kind of stuff right i like see i like to see if these things these little things happen or not anyway thank you so much for watching again let me know your favorite thing about this movie and why would you recommend it or why wouldn't you recommend it thank you so much for watching me on all of my platforms another youtube channel my twitch instagram etc it does really mean a lot to me thank you again to my patreons and uh i hope to see you next time Bye bye